There we go. Nice. Freaking slam that thing too. <laughs> Not that big of a fish for how big of a swim bait that is, right? Nope. <laughs> pond this morning that I fished one other time just a few days ago with my nephew just for a few minutes I mean the pond doesn't take very long to fish anyway but fished it for just a few minutes the other day and lost one good one and caught another little fish on my big swim bait here that I've been throwing lately anyway I'm here real early to try to get another one on that audio might be a little weird because some kind of workout deal or something going on in this parking lot this morning but anyway here to try to get another big fish that I know lives in this pond so uh, see how we can do with that big swim bait again and a whopper plover to start out and then I've got a couple other things to throw if I don't get bit on those but like I said this is a pretty tiny pond it should only take a few minutes really to or not a few minutes but definitely not more than an hour to walk around at one time so we'll fish it real quick this morning and see what we can do they're all carrying American flags whatever they're doing so I'm cool with that Ooh, there's a nice one. Crush that whopper plopper. Crushed it right there, that was nice. Not quite as good of a fish as I thought, but it'll definitely do in this tiny little pond, that's for sure. That's a that's a nice healthy one there. I don't know why I was complaining. That's a fine fish right there. Plenty healthy. Real good fish actually. Solid, solid fish there on that whopper plopper. Thank you for playing little buddy. Oh, that was a nice blow up there again. Man, these are some hard fighting suckers too. They fight very good in this pond. Oh yeah. Oh, don't get away, bud. Don't get away, I just wanna say hi. Another one, another good one. That blew up that whopper plopper very nicely that was very fun again another nice healthy bass on the whopper plopper 
another one that blew it up good. Thanks for playing, buddy. Another one. Feels like another decent one, too. For the whopper plopper. Tearing them up this morning, oh yeah. Another good fish. Another hard fighter. Oh, stay away from there. Oh, he come off right there. Dang it. Oh well. I got the most out of him I could. Fought him all the way to the bank. That was another good little fish too. They are tearing this whopper plopper up this morning. Still yet to get bit on my big swim bait, but I'm waiting for it. I'm thinking I'm gonna get a big, big one to eat this. There we go. Just as I was talking. One ate it. See how big it is. Not that big, but another fish and another one for the bullgill swim bait. Actually the smallest fish of the day on the big swim bait. Kind of ironic, but Little fish will eat big baits, that's for sure. Well, even though that's not what I'm looking for, throwing a big swim bait, I'll definitely take it. Thank you for playing, little buddy. Well, apparently, I just gotta talk about it and I'll get bit. That was pretty cool. Definitely not the fish I'm looking for when I'm throwing a bait like this, but. I'll take it. It's always cool to get bit on a big swim bait like this. One of my favorite ways to do it. Another one on the swim bait. There we go. Nice. Another small one though. The swim bait is not getting bigger bites, it's actually getting smaller bites. It's kind of weird, but that is the way it works sometimes. It's just so realistic it'll get anything to bite but it's not necessarily the bigger fish sometimes another little one on the big bull gill swim bait thanks for playing little buddy oh no dang it there was another one on the bull gill that one felt better, of course. Of course, the one that trucks it like that comes off. Golly. As you can see, it's overcast this morning and it looks like we've got even some more weather moving in. Some more rain that we've had over the past couple days. But looks like there's more of it coming. Should prolong this bite I might be able to fish back over some stuff actually and get bit the second time around I don't know see what happens here well it looks like the rain is actually holding off so I've gone around the pond once the whole pond been here about 30 40 minutes I've already gone around the pond one time so I'm gonna tie on a, a walking style top water and then a smaller swim bait for my two baits that I'm gonna throw on the way back. Just cause I think the two styles are still good for right now in this overcast. 
early morning deal. I think they're still going to be eaten. You don't need to really throw a bottom bait, but I just want to give them a couple different looks than what I've given them so far. I might be able to go right back over the same spots with the same baits and get bit even, but I'm just going to change it up a little bit here on the way back. Got my Strike King Sexy Dog tied on for my walk-in top water on the way back. And then I've got just a little Bass Pro Shops bluegill swim bait. See what we can do with these two baits. Oh yeah, that was a nice, nice hit on the little sexy dog, little fish, but very nice blow up. If I'm going to catch a little guy like that, that's how I want to catch him, blowing up the top water. I think he's good. Thank you for blowing my bait up like that, little buddy. That was fun. Get back around those fountains and I get bit again. That's always a good place. In a pond that has a fountain like that, it's always cooler, more oxygenated water right by the fountains. So in the summertime, that's definitely a good spot for them to be hanging. That was a nice blow up. That was very nice. I was just sitting here thinking that maybe I just caught all the fish I was gonna catch today. And then that decent little dude right there came and interrupted my thoughts. That was a nice blow up. Very nice indeed. Thank you very much, little dude. Well, I fished around the pond twice now in pretty much an hour. As you can tell, it's a pretty tiny pond, so it doesn't take many casts to cover it, but fished the whole thing twice in about an hour. Got a couple bites on that sexy dog on the way back, but Nothing on the little swim bait. It's kind of surprising, but I think that ultra low light this morning was was good. It was good to get here before the sun came up where they couldn't really get a good look at me on the bank or my baits in the water or anything like that. But anyway, fun little morning session. Now it's time to go to work.